I'm reading the four kinds of happiness from the numerical discourses of the Buddha. Then the householder, Anattapindika, approached the Blessed One, and the Blessed One said to him, There are, householder, these four kinds of happiness which may be achieved by a lay person who enjoys sensual pleasures, depending on time and occasion. What for? The happiness of possession, the happiness of enjoyment, the happiness of debtlessness, and the happiness of blamelessness. And what householder is the happiness of possession? Here, a family person possesses wealth acquired by energetic striving, amassed by the strength of his or her arms, earned by the sweat of his or her brow, righteous wealth, righteously gained. When she thinks, I possess wealth acquired by energetic striving, amassed by the strength of my arms, earned by the sweat of my brow, righteous wealth righteously gained. She experiences happiness and joy. This is called the happiness of possession. And what householder is a happiness of enjoyment? Here with the wealth acquired by energetic striving, amassed by the strength of his arms, earned by the sweat of his brow, righteous wealth righteously gained. A family man enjoys his wealth and does meritorious deeds. When he thinks, with the wealth acquired by energetic striving, amassed by the strength of my arms, earned by the sweat of my brow, righteous wealth, righteously gained. I enjoy my wealth and do meritorious deeds. He experiences happiness and joy. This is called the happiness of enjoyment. And what householder is a happiness of debtlessness? Here, a family person is not indebted to anyone to any degree, whether small or great. When he thinks, I am not indebted to anyone to any degree, whether small or great, he experiences happiness and joy. This is called the happiness of debtlessness. And what householder is a happiness of blamelessness? Here, householder, a noble disciple, is endowed with blameless conduct of deed, word, and thought. When he thinks, I am endowed with blameless conduct of deed, word, and thought, he experiences happiness and joy. This is called the happiness of blamelessness. These, householder, are the four kinds of happiness that a lay person who enjoys sensual pleasures may achieve depending on time and occasion. Having known the bliss of debtlessness and further the bliss of possession, enjoying the bliss of enjoyment, a mortal then sees with wisdom. While seeing with wisdom, the wise one knows both shares of his happiness. The other is not worth a sixteenth part of the bliss that comes from blamelessness.